Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm reviewing this product from this brand name Beauty of Jason. This is their Relief Sun Rice Plus Probiotics Sunscreen SPF 50 plus PA plus 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 plus. I paid $15 for this sunscreen and we get 50 ml product. I loved this sunscreen so much I purchased it again. This sunscreen is fragrance free, essential oil free, drying type of alcohol free. If you care about parabens and silicones, this is paraben free and silicone free as well. This sunscreen is not fungal acne safe. This sunscreen is not sweat and water resistant. This is a very lightweight sunscreen, a winter sunscreen. And if I'm not wrong, Beauty of Jason is cruelty free. So this sunscreen has four new generation chemical filters. These new generation chemical filters are more sensitive skin friendly and they are very stable. This has UVNL A+. UVNL A plus is very photostable, it protects your skin from UVA rays. This has UVNL C150. UVNL C150 protects your skin from UVB rays. This has Tinosorb M. Tinosorb M provides great protection against UVA and UVB rays. Tinosorb M leaves white cast. I will talk about that later in this video. And this has this filter name Isotrisinol or USORB HEB. I hope I'm pronouncing the name right. So this filter is very photostable. It loses 10% of its SPF protection abilities in 25 hours. And this, per, this filter protects your skin from UVB and UVA2 range. Other than these four new generation chemical filters, this has some other great ingredients. This has rice extract 30%. Rice extract is great. It's anti-aging, it's brightening, it helps with dark spots and redness. This has glycerin. Glycerin is a great humectant. This has adenosine. Adenosine is a great anti-aging ingredient. This has vitamin E. Vitamin E is a great antioxidant. This also has green tea extract. Green tea extract is anti-aging. It also controls excess sebum. And this also has ginseng root extract. Ginseng root extract is brightening. It helps with redness. It's anti-aging. And they added some ferment ingredients in this sunscreen. Ferment ingredients are smaller in size, they penetrate deep into our skin, they work faster, they are great anti-aging, brightening, they help with dark spots. But this is a sunscreen, so I don't know if they are going to penetrate deep into our skin because you know sunscreens sit on top of your skin. And I forgot to mention this also has niacinamide. Niacinamide is great, it's anti-aging, it's brightening, it helps with dark spots. If your moisture barrier is disturbed, niacinamide help with that. So let's talk about my experience with this sunscreen. You guys, I am obsessed. I love this sunscreen so much. This sunscreen went viral and I can see why everybody loved this sunscreen. In my opinion, yes, this sunscreen deserves all the hype. Love it so much. I literally finished this so fast. I love it. I love it so much. I have combination skin. My skin is more on the oilier side in summer and more on the dry side in winters. Right now, weather is good here. My skin is more on the dry side. I'm loving this. This is a light lotion. Um, on my combination skin that is more on the dry side right now, for me, this absorbs really fast. In like 10 minutes, this disappears into my skin and leaves this really healthy glow behind. On my combination skin that is more on the dry side, it's not shiny. It's not sticky. It leave glow behind and I love that glow to be honest it look really healthy my skin look really healthy look really pretty love the finish of this sunscreen of course this is not sweat and water resistant so I cannot use this in summer if you have dry skin or combination skin that is more on the dry side I think you will love this sunscreen if you have really dry skin you will definitely need a moisturizer under this if you have combination skin that is more on the oilier side and you live in a colder country, I think you will be fine using this sunscreen. But if you have really oily skin, I think this will be heavy for you. I don't think this is a good option for people who have really oily skin. And the white cast of this sunscreen, on my complexion, with first application, three finger method, I don't see white cast, this don't get stuck in my facial hair. But with second application, I see a little bit white cast with the sunscreen. If you have deeper skin tone, I think white cast of this sunscreen will be noticeable on your complexion. 
But if your complexion is similar to my complexion or lighter than my complexion, then I don't think you will have any issue with this sunscreen. Now, if you have really sensitive skin, skin that is very reactive, if you have rosacea or eczema, the combination of these chemical filters and ferment ingredients, it can be irritating. So be careful. My neck is really sensitive. I'm using this sunscreen without any issue. But if your skin is really reactive, then be careful with this. If you will experience redness, itchiness, then stop using this sunscreen. My experience with this sunscreen was great. I will definitely repurchase this. I love this sunscreen so much. I can see why everybody loves this sunscreen. It's great. If you have dry skin or combination skin that is more on the dry side, you're going to love this. If you live in a colder country and you have combination skin that is more on the oilier side, I think you will be fine using this. If you have oily skin, you will find it heavy. But yeah, dry skin, combination skin, I think you will really enjoy this. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.